what do I think about medium? And uh, is it worth doing? Is it worth spending your time on? Um, well, first I wanna show you when medium is done well, what does it look like? And I have an example from Bing Huang here. Thank you for sharing your example with us. Let me go and share the screen. So definitely check out Bing's medium.com profile. It's bingshuang.medium.com or just look, search her name on medium and you should be able to find her. And I just think Bing's does medium really well. I mean, she, she kind of checks all the boxes. Um, she contributes to publications. She connects with other medium users. She gets a lot more claps than I do. She gets a lot more traction. Um, medium now has a way for people to subscribe <clears throat> to your publication through, and I think that's automated, right? Um, and being, being you're here right now, so feel free to unmute if you wanna correct me uh, on anything. Now, let me show you an example of someone doing medium not so well. Me, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I, I, I out myself as somebody who is, is really half-assing it too much on medium. And the reason why, and I'll show you why I'm not doing it well. Look at, look at this. My numbers are pitiful uh, for somebody who has been on medium for years. I've been on medium for years. I have, what is it? I have, I have something like 2000, I have, how many followers do I have? I have, um, I have 2,600 followers and my stats are, 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 are pretty sad. I mean, I get, I get a, a few dozen views from my articles. I get like one fan if I'm lucky for my, for my articles. So, so I'll be honest with you, I, I am, I'm only using Medium just because I'm a marketing coach and I'm supposed to know how to use every marketing tool. So I'm really doing it in the way that's, so the, whenever I get traction on Medium is when I include a link to my Medium article in my email newsletter. And then people click through and they read the article on Medium and a few of them might clap it up and share it. And that's the only time I get a little bit of traction. So um, I, I wanna say this, if you're, so don't have the fantasy, I'll say, don't have the fantasy of just being able to post stuff on Medium and just like sit back and go, ah, oh, it's going viral. It's never happened for me. I mean, I think it happened once or twice, but that was towards the beginning. I've been on Medium since pretty close to the beginning when it first started. And back then it was much easier to go viral. And I had a couple of things go viral on Medium and I thought, oh, Medium is easy, you know? But ever since, whenever it was like 2015 or 2016, ever since then, it's like, it's been, it's been a slog, man, to try to, so I, and, and you can't spend advertising dollars at this time of this recording, you can't run ads on Medium to show people your stuff. I hope they, they put that into view and some of your, some of your Medium users, oh, I hope they never have advertising on Medium. But for those of us who want to get stuff out, we hope there's advertising at some point so we can spend some money to get in front of thousands of people. Right now, I'm getting a few dozen views with 2,000 followers. And if I don't promote it at all, you know, I just have, I just have like remnant residual subscribers or residual fans out of my 2,000 that's getting it. So um, I do want to, again, recommend uh, Bing's as a resource for actually how to, if you, wanna, if you, if you like Medium, you want to spend the effort to, to do it right, definitely check out what Bing's has to say. And she has an article here why Medium is an excellent content uh, platform. And, um, and you can see Bing's other articles about Medium and, and you could basically, um, yeah. So there's some helpful stuff here and how do you, and, and there's actually also a lot of other people writing um, on Medium about how to make Medium work. Like if you, if you just wanna Google, or, you know, Google like how to get more readers from my Medium articles or whatever i mean you'll you get plenty of, but but to be honest like i said i i feel like medium um to me it takes it 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 feels to me it takes more energy than i'm willing to give it maybe that's why i'm half-assing compared to for example facebook instagram ads and linkedin ads if you're willing to spend the money it's like oh my god it's so much easier to just get my stuff out in front of Oh, lots and lots of the right people. It's just, it just takes some money. So if you're, if you're like, if you're willing to spend like between $30 to hundred dollars a month to run ads on your content, I think Facebook, Instagram ads, and maybe LinkedIn ads, it's just a better use of time. If you have that budget, just to get the, get your content, your writing, including your writing, including 
and links to your Medium articles, right? You could, you could, you could run ads to send people to Medium articles using Facebook, Instagram, and LinkedIn. So I hope that helps.